Sarah Oden. Thank you very much, uh, Madam Deputy Speaker. Um, the human rights abuses of the Sri Lankan police force have been well documented, um, and it's been clear in their response uh, to, to the widespread protests that we've seen that their uh, unacceptable treatment of the people in Sri Lanka, and particularly the Tamil community, uh, and their draconian powers have been a, a key contributor to the current unrest. Now, the UK government has been funding police training in Sri Lanka, despite clear evidence of these abuses. Can the Minister confirm whether those police and security forces involved in the response to these protests have received funding from the UK Government, and will she commit to ending this funding as soon as possible? Yeah. I thank the Honourable la la Lady for her question. So the UK's police training in Sri Lanka has focused on the role of women in the police service and improving responses to sexual and gender-based violence. Police Scotland have confirmed that they will not seek to participate in any future programmes in Sri Lanka. 